hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is vicky yeah you guys <laughs> okay okay let me be calm because i think that i'm letting my emotions for beauty's disqualification just get a better part of me you guys beauty's disqualification it's really like heartbreaking or i'm, I'm disappointed at her and i'm also shocked at the way big brother just judge the whole matter you understand i don't know whether the judgment was too harsh or, but to be honest maybe what i was expecting was like a warning if at all there was one was a like a warning or something not even a strike to be really honest maybe because we didn't see where she flung her wig her glasses and the bottle at um um groovy you understand or a can or something at groovy and maybe they saw it you guess but to be really honest her outburst last night was uncalled for completely she messed up and yeah we blamed it on johnny walker like alcohol you guess but that's not an excuse if you don't say your head no good it is better you just stay away from it because it don't do you the first week you saw how you reacted it got you a strike if this show was really important to you i feel like you would have adjusted you would have known that okay i think if i'm in my normal sense i would be able to avoid these things but if i add alcohol to it I could just go haywire you understand so i just feel like maybe she doesn't have a lot to lose or maybe oh more you know she's a beauty queen now she just come here to just she doesn't care about the price she doesn't care she just felt like maybe she came to catch her cruise i don't understand because i don't know why man where you go meet for just two weeks baby just did the vibe and then you they react like this if people dance for her now you don't go outside now you go to watch and through tv when you go to dance the robot that people bomb bomb you understand so what you go do you go break your tv i think at the end of the day i feel like beauty's people should just try she needs a therapy period there's nothing anybody can tell me she needs a therapist at the moment because she needs anger management how to control her emotions you get because some of us are good at talking and criticizing people but maybe if they put us in an enclosed space like that, that's where we find ourselves even more. That's when we know who we really are, you get. I think, and that's the, might be the situation of hers because almost her, her anger, no be here. If you leave her, she's going to be fighting every now and then over a man. And it actually doesn't make any sense to me. Anyway, last, last, and don't disqualify her. And you guys, to the gist of this particular video, Saif and Chrisio has actually been disqualified and to be really honest with you guys i wasn't expecting saif let's just be honest because i don't know if it's just me but i felt like saif was creative in the house saif was okay like saif was trying was really helping the house to be creative trying to be involved in everything and it depends on really what the, what the audience or people who are voting I feel like we vote more on social media and we don't go to actually do the votes that we are supposed to do to keep our faiths in the house and unfortunately Saif and Christy O we are evicted. It's time for our very first eviction of the season. So will all nominated housemates please stand. The first housemate to be evicted from the Big Brother Niger level of season is Christy O. Christy O was the first person that was evicted and Saif was the second person that was evicted tonight. The next housemate to leave the Big Brother Niger level up house is Saif. And then there was a twist that Big Brother actually brought into the game tonight. Guess what, guys? Big Brother actually introduced two new housemates into the house in the name of Rachel and Cheesy. We are introduced into the game. Like Big Brother does, they bring housemates every week. You get. How you doing? <laughs> What's going through your mind right now? Hello. Like, I'm super excited to be here. Alright, so the show is two weeks in already. What are you going to do to ruffle feathers to make the viewers get to know you and like you? Well, I'm not a woman of many words, exactly. But I am here to play the game. And Rachel went into the island house. That's house one. Hey, my name is Rachel. Hi, Rachel. And I'm the new housemate. <laughs> yeah. Is 
And Cheesy actually went into the trenches house too. You understand? Hi, Cheesy. And you guys, you won't even believe it. But when um, Cheesy walked into the house, you could see the excitement in Amaka's face. Like Amaka was like, "Oh, thank God, big brother don't bring fire, boy." You never even know whether or she then go evict. But immediately because they walked into the house before they were they, they carried out an eviction. You understand? But at the end of the day, she wasn't the one that was evicted, but she was really happy that a new guy is in the house. So let us keep an eye on Amaka and know what Amaka is up to because as it is right now, Amaka is in their hunt for a man. Amaka is in their need of a sheep because. What are we going to call this one? You guys. And then Rachel was put into the island house, which is house one. The housemates were surprised. You know how big he is now. He will always, always give you one thing to be surprised about. Like, so that it doesn't seem as if we all are guessing the game and all that. So that's just it, guys. Omar, a disqualification, the eviction, two eviction, two evicted housemates, Christy O and Saif. I know we'll tell you like. I didn't see the scythe on coming and I actually did not see the disqualification of beauty coming this early but there was a trait that the way she's going she might not get to the end of the show without being disqualified she had a trait of being the disqualified one in this season right from the first week but I was just praying and hoping she would keep her emotions in check I, I was just praying and hoping you understand so that's just it. and Ebuka um introduced the other two housemates as rider the rachel and cheesy guy that they are rider they are not eligible to win the prize and they cannot be if they're evicted they will have to stay till the end of the show maybe they have like a mission they have to act, they will have to carry out for big brother you know how this game is being done now so these people are maybe not tagged fake housemates they are tagged as riders Nobody then go win, none of them go win the 100 million. So even if then they put them up for possible um, nomination for eviction, they no go go. You understand? They will stay till the end of the show. So maybe by tomorrow we'll know the kind of duties they are here to carry out for Big Brother. And the other girl that came, Modella that came, where Big Brother don't give work, say, make she do, make she scatter relationship. Chomzy is busy doing it effortlessly for Modella. And Modella is just there moping. And I'm like, Modella, when you want to start your work? When you won't start with carry you come this house, like what they are saying you to come do when you won't do one because she's not even like I don't even see the need of she coming in. That's my opinion. Maybe much later she might, you know, give us the vibe, you understand? But I feel like now if now she even caused the katakata when chums the cause with beauty leave, I will be like, Okay, big brother, your plan don't work. But um Modella is just there, just sitting like less concerned. Like I said, they don't send and walk, you understand? Anyway, guys, that's just it. I just said I should come give you the gist. There's been an eviction of two housemates and a disqualification. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll definitely see you all in my next one. Bye, guys.